guys, it's me Sunny here. Welcome back to another video. In this video, something I'm very excited about. Um, I got the new Furby and I'm very excited about this. I do have a soft spot for Furbies and I've been really excited about this new one. I was really surprised that it's already out. I feel like it just came out so fast. Um, but I think it looks really cute and I'm just so excited to try it. Uh, and I kind of have a soft spot for Furbies because I had one as like a, a kid and there's a picture I'll insert here of like my sister and I with our Furbies. I think we were like in our primary school uniform on that picture and I just love that picture. I think it's so cute and I just remember my parents surprising us with the Furbies. Um, I actually looked into it and found that those Furbies were actually the baby Furbies. Which makes sense because I couldn't find them online when I was searching but then I realised because they were actually baby Furbies and they weren't very popular I don't think. Um, but we loved them. They had like little baby bottles and oh, they were so cute. I really want to try and find that for sale and buy it again because I don't think I have my anymore unless it's somewhere in my parents house in like the attic or something. I don't know. But then when I was like, I think it was for my 11th birthday, I really wanted the 2012 Furby. But I really wanted the new Furby at the time. Now this isn't the same one from my childhood, unfortunately. I just got this one uh, a few days ago. But this is the one that I had that I got for my birthday. This red one with like the teal hair. I always, I just love the color combination so much. And I've been looking to get him again online for a while. And I finally found him just in time for this review. So I'm really, really happy about that because it's just so nostalgic. And like, I thought that, like, it feels so much smaller because I've grown <laughs> that I, I thought they were bigger than this. But no, this is a normal size. He's asleep right now with his eyes open. He does work and everything, but I don't want to wake him up yet. But we'll wake him up later in the video. But it's really cool having, like, the same one that I had as a kid. And this one's in great. He's, oh, oh no. I woke him up. He was actually, um, he was evil when I first turned him on from previous owner, so I turned him, I, I reset him to the default one. So cute. But yeah, I absolutely love this baby when I was a kid. I, I played with it all the time. These ones, um, don't turn off though. So you just have to are you dancing? <laughs> Why are you dancing? <laughs> I'm just gonna put him in a corner <laughs> until he falls asleep. Unless there's a secret way of turning them off. I don't know. But, <coughs> I remember as a kid, um, he would randomly just wake up in the middle of the night and start talking, because that was always fun. But yeah, me and my friend had a Furby and we would always play with him together and like, talk to each other. We even had those little ones. I can't remember what they called those, but we had those ones too. Um, so that's my Furby history, my Furby lore, those are the Furbies that I've owned before. But anyways, we're here for the new Furby today. Honestly, I don't know a whole lot about this one. I did watch the trailer though, when it, you know, first came out. I know one of the bigger things is that they speak English a lot more. Like, usually with Furby, they don't speak English, you gotta like, teach them English. <laughs> um, which really, they just, they will start speaking more English the more you play with them. But I think this one just speaks English, like mostly, and a little bit of furbish breathing exercises what that's so cute okay i love that plus it comes with fashion accessories furby string comb 12 clip beads and a pizza charm which i think is really cute because i noticed that in the furby community people love to make like little charm like necklaces for their furbies which i've been really wanting to do so the fact this one comes with one already is really cute i feel like they probably did that because that's a big thing that people do to furbies and i know they oh yeah it says here does not connect to the internet um, which I think they put because like parents are always concerned about that so this one doesn't do that I'm kind of glad it doesn't because like the Furby apps were fun at the time but I don't know I feel like they don't age well probably can't even get into the apps anymore but like the other Furbies that have apps like my one I think has an app um, which was fun I think I think I remember trying to play the app and it would always crash and it was so slow on like whatever phone I had at the time um, but yeah, so this one doesn't have an app or anything, which is nice. <laughs> Tell my fortune and other play modes are for entertainment purposes only. Pull here to start. Your voice unlocks ultimate Furby friendship. Alright. Pull here. Oh. Okay. Oh yeah, plastic free packaging by the way. We love that. Oh, this is so cute. Keep out Furby and bestie only. 
There are other colors, by the way, but this is the only one I actually saw on the shelf. But I have seen other colors online. I think there's a sort of rainbow one coming out. But I really like this purple and blue one. I think the colors are really cute. It's cool. Oh my god, that's so cute. Okay. Oh my god, I love the colorfulness. Oh my goodness, you're so cute. Oh my god, you're so soft. Okay, also comes with, oh my god, it's this little cardboard like bedroom. This is so adorable. I love the vibes. Oh my god, there's like a retro Furby on his shelf. The vibes for this are so good. This is adorable. You got a Squishmallow over here. Oh my god, he's got like a little Tamagotchi. This is so cute. This is really like early 2000s core. So here's our Furby. So you do need to get your own batteries. You've got those batteries and screwdriver to get Furby out of here. This is adorable. So like it tells, like shows you, you know, you can decorate your Furby with the necklaces or you can use them on yourself. That's adorable. Oh my god. And they can interact with other Furbies um, of the same generation. So like this Furby won't be able to interact with my other Furby. But we can still, they can probably still like talk. I probably will sort of like back and forth to each other because Furbies interact with any noise anyway. Interesting. So, oh yeah, the gem button. So that's like a button on their head. Cool. Okay, cool. They're so cute. I know a lot of people don't really like that they went for with more like a cutesy vibe. I feel like Furby's kind of known to like look like a strange c creature that kind of looks, used to look a bit ugly. Um, but I don't know. I like the cutesy vibe as well. I do. I do like the the older ones, the ugly ones too. But I think it's I think it's fun. All right. So Furby's really easy to get out because his bum's like attached to the box. But once you unscrew this, he comes out of the cardboard. And then you got to put the batteries in. So it needs four AA batteries, which is the same amount as the last Furby needed. Okay. 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 You guys ready? Okay. You ready? Hey Furby. Okay, so now you guys can get a bit of look at his little feet moving. And as you can see, this one's... Quiz, Unai, is hot dog sandwich? Mm? That is a good question. I don't know. So his mouth doesn't move. <laughs> Unlike other generations of Furby, which is an interesting choice. I'm not really sure why they didn't want to do that anymore, because I always liked that. But, I don't know, I don't mind too much. <laughs> Also, the rainbow eyes are really adorable, and his ears are so cool! I just love the big lights on the ears. He can still eat, though, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Oh, I, I guess you can feed him the pizza, too, huh? So he comes with a little Furby-shaped comb. You ju I just fed you. Okay, let me give you some pizza. Oh my. <laughs> so 
so you can comb his little hair. The hair is so soft, by the way. It's different. Like, it's a nice, softer material compared to the last, to, to my Furby. Oh my god, he's so cute. I don't mind that it speaks English, too. <laughs> like, like, it's pretty adorable. So here's the little string you get for the little necklace, Furby's little necklace. And then you... Oh my god. <laughs> Did you just say big oof? Okay. It's a little bit outdated, Furby, but you know, we'll let it slide. Um, so you get a bunch of these cute little huh. chums that you just clip together. So you can either put them on the <laughs> you can clip them on the bracelet or you can clip it in oh, yeah. Furby's oh, hair. Yeah. Hey Furby. Tell my fortune. Okay, there we go. Rub Furby Belly to see future. Belly rub, please. Okay. <laughs> New door will open. Old door will close. Go through open door. Okay. For another fortune. Okay, um. Whoa. Okay, time to relax. Oh, we're relaxing. And let's take deep breaths. Ready? Close eyes and think of happy place. Breathe in. This is so cute. Breathe out. Think of someone Unila very much. Breathe in. Breathe out. Feel your feet against floor. Breathe in. Breathe out. And Unai can hear sound of ocean. This is adorable. <laughs> There you go. Got your necklace on. Isn't that so cute? Ah, feel much better. Okay, I love the little coming thing. That's really cute, especially like for, like kids and stuff that actually genuinely like might help a lot of kids just to like breathe and chill. You know, that's adorable. All right, let's try. Should we do the dance party again? Also, he can repeat what we say. How do we do that? Copycat. Okay. <clears throat> Let's try that. OMG! Freddy gets love when I hear. Oh, thank you. Hey, Furby. Copycat. Say something to Furby, and Furby say it back. Pee pee poo poo. Chipmunk. Hatch Furby has <laughs> very mother voice. Okay. <laughs> Pee pee poo poo, pee pee poo poo. <laughs> Giant! <laughs> oh my god. Copycat unlocked! Poke Furby Belly to hear again! Pee pee poo poo. Hatch Furby Head for another voice! Space Cadet! <laughs> Alright, that's, that's really fun, not gonna lie. Okay, wait, hang on, hang on. I'm trying to put more beads on your necklace. Oh yeah, okay, I'll feed you. So, I wonder if this one, I guess this one probably doesn't have like different personalities, right? Does it just stay like this? I mean, it does say that it's still like learns things the more you play with it. So that's fun. Should we do? Maybe feel like fourteen out of ten 
Tridon right now. Tridon's body. Hey, Furby. Hey, Furby. Dance party. So I definitely can't play the whole song because I probably will get copyright claimed, but they're really cute. Alright. We can try light show, which makes Furby's ears light up for 10 minutes. Interesting. Hey Furby. Light show. Aurora Furby Alice. So is that kind of like a nightlight thing? I think so. That's cute. So you can tap the head to see different colour patterns, touch the tummy for special light effects. Okay. So I guess that just changes the lights on his ears. Beautiful dream. <laughs> That's pretty cute. And then we can easily turn this Furby off, thankfully, by just pressing the button on his head three times. And he's off. So that's nice, makes it a lot easier instead of just waiting. And I think we just wake him back up by pressing the button again. Oh, oh, Furby just had weirdest dream. Furby was small, fuzzy creature with glowing ears and- Wait a minute! <laughs> that's so cute! I love him, I love him so much. Woo! Furby feel like a chunky furball! You are a chunky furball. I just realized this one doesn't have a tail. What? I wasn't speaking to you. It doesn't have a tail. I don't think the original one did though. Oh, nice words, Nuna. Thank you. I love his eyes. I love his eyelashes. He's got eyelashes. So cute. I just realized some of these beads have letters on it to spell out Furby and I just put them in random places. <laughs> um but yeah I think he's so cute and I think I think it's really cute how he like responds to what you're saying and like the chill mode I think is such a really good idea. He says a lot of different things too. Like there's so many different things that he's saying like, I haven't heard much repeats. So that's very really cool. Why Furby no wear shoes? Huh? <laughs> like what? He says such random things. Oh yeah! <laughs> I love it. So yeah, I mean, if, if you like Furbies, I definitely recommend this. I think a kid would absolutely love this, or someone like me. <laughs> Super Furby. fun. And I can't wait to see more, more like Furby, Furby stuff that they do in the future. You know, maybe they'll do more Furby babies. I want more Furby babies. They're really cute. It's only some. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I want to wake up this Furby now. <clears throat> also, he just changed personality off camera, like just just before when I was waiting for him to go to sleep. Which I th I think this is the baby personality. I don't think his eyes very well on camera, can you? But it's a, it's a really cute personality. What what just happened? Oh, okay. You just taking a nap?
So they are the same size. <laughs> He's dancing. But they are actually like the same price, I'm pretty sure, in New Zealand dolls anyway, like when this came out. Oh my god, did he just say spill the tea? <laughs> <laughs> they actually are kind of like talking to each other because he keeps dancing. How about you guys dance together? Hey, Furby. Hey, Furby. Dance party. Oh, okay. You need to move out of the way. Hey, Furby. Dance party. So yeah, the songs do make my other Furby dance. <laughs> so yeah, this one obviously has like way more movement, which I kind of miss, to be honest. I hope they do make one with more movement like this. My theory is maybe um, they have less like movement and stuff is to keep this Furby affordable because one thing that surprised me is that these Furbies are actually like I don't want to move them too much. Sorry, I'm holding you by the hair. Um, these Furbies are actually like the same price. I'm pretty sure from what I remember, this one was a hundred New Zealand dollars when it came out. This one is the same price. That's New Zealand dollars, remember? Which really surprised me. Like I thought these would be more because obviously the price of like everything's gone up. But I think maybe um, they didn't add as much like features like moving features to keep them at a same similar price point you know because I feel like if this could move as much and like had the had the beak that would move and whatever it would be more expensive to do that these days than it was back then so it would cost a lot more maybe that's my theory but I hope they maybe do one that can move more one day also one thing I really like about this one is it doesn't have that high pitch like noise that you hear with the old ones. I don't know if like everyone can hear it, but this one, like when it's si like when it's not talking, it lets off like a high pitch noise. I don't know if everyone can hear that because I feel like only some people can hear that frequency, but it's it really bothers me. Um, but that's what they do. I remember my one did it when I was a kid too, and this one does it as well. Um, the new one doesn't do that, so that's oh no. I woke him up. So that's definitely a highlight for me that they don't do that anymore. Oh, I woke you up as well. Maybe shaking wakes him up too. Okay, so it's now been a couple of weeks since I actually filmed the re review part of this video. Um, oh, because <laughs> I wanted to come back after playing with them for a bit longer to kind of discuss like, <laughs> okay, Toby really wants attention right now. New Furby alert, new Furby alert. I wanted to properly kind of discuss the differences between these two <laughs> now that I've had the time to <laughs> play with them both more. And I will start off by saying that I do think the new one is better. There are like some things that I do wish that the new one did have that the old one has. And the old one is still very, very different. So, I mean, some people might prefer the old one. So I want to start off with the things that I wish this one did have that this one has. And that is like the more movability and the moving a mouse, which I already kind of talked about and talked about my theory and why it doesn't have that anymore. But yeah, I do, I will say like, I do kind of miss that. Like this one, it can move its whole body as you could see in the video. I'm not gonna wake it up because then it'll be very loud. Move its whole like body in and out. Uh, and its mouth obviously opens when it talks, which would be cool if this one had that. But I'm gonna theorize that there is a reason why it doesn't like potentially to cut costs to make this um affordable or potentially because the way this one does move is very different um like this one can move its little feeties as you saw and we can see here i might end up waking them up by doing this but so the feet are actually on these little little 
things that actually move you know the feet actually move on this one the feet are actually fabric and the feet don't actually move um but oh there it goes it has these at the bottom of it on its bum which gives the illusion that the feet are moving so i do like the way this one's <laughs> got the hiccups this one's feet actually move it looks better uh, and also the way the ears move on this one too. So in this one, the older one, the ears move forward and back. Like this. As you, uh, as you can see. Um, I'm kind of scared. What, what, what's going on? This one they move like side to side and it looks really nice and like satisfying the way that this one moves. It's also not as loud. This one is... Oh, it's making a high pitch sound again. I don't know if you can hear it on camera, but it's it's a very annoying sound. And also, like, makes a lot of clicking. It makes a lot of robotic sounds, which is understandable. Hey, I'm putting you away. You can sit there. So let's turn this one on again. <laughs> obviously, it still makes like the robotic sounds. Obviously, it's a robot. But they're a lot quieter, a lot less noticeable. That's what was going to say. And I just love the way the ears move. It's really smooth and satisfying. And we can turn them off really easily. <laughs> Thank goodness. <laughs> now, this old Toby, they have like different personalities that they can switch to, which some people might like, some people might not like that. I mean, I think it's kind of fun. I did like it when I was a kid. I liked turning them evil and stuff. Um, and it's it's a fun gimmick, but like it can be a little annoying if you want to keep your Furby in like one personality because they can just change it randomly. Like if you play, if you do too much things to it, they will change. Like there's there's ways of changing the personality, and like for example, you feed it too much, it might change into a different one, etc. Which can be a bit annoying, but it's fun. This one it doesn't change personality, but it says a lot more things. It's still saying things that I haven't heard before. I like that it speaks English because now you can actually understand what it's saying. This Furby just kind of repeats the same things. It gets very repetitive quite quickly. This one doesn't. Obviously it does repeat what it says, but not nearly as repetitive. It has a lot more things it says. It also has a lot more features. The one I do miss though, this one can dance when it hears music, it starts dancing. This one doesn't do that, but he does play his own music and his own songs. But uh, I kind of wish that it, he, did, he could detect music and dance to it, like this one can. Um, but instead, this one, obviously, you can do the dance party feature and you can play different songs. And, like, there is a lot of songs. Like, he keeps unlocking new ones, too. Like, the more you play with that feature, he'll tell you, oh, new song unlocked. And you've got another new song, which is really cool. Um, and same with the other features, he unlocks more stuff, like copycat. He unlocks more voices to do. And, yeah, it's really easy and fun to, like, play with those features. With um, Chill Out, he unlocks more methods of like breathing exercises and chilling and stuff which is very cool one of the ones he did which i really liked um i didn't i didn't record it but it just happened when i was playing with him one of the chill out features he said things like name uh three things you hear three things you feel three things you smell like this is something that people use as like an exercise to help with like panic attacks and stuff so i thought that was a really cool thing that he does that that's something that I used to do when I had panic attacks as a kid. So I feel like that's gonna actually really help a lot of kids and a lot of people. So I, I really love that. Like the chill out feature is really, really cool. I think it's great for kids who might be struggling with anxiety and stuff. I haven't played around too much with the fortune telling ability, but basically just says your fortune or whatever. But yeah, I think I've only done that one twice because it's not that interesting to me, but I've used dance party and chill out a lot and copycat is, is pretty funny. I was showing the copycat ability to my sister because I thought it was really funny. Even she was saying the sound quality is like really good on the microphone. I didn't realize that but yeah it actually is. Of course this Furby has like the LED eyes which this one doesn't. The LED eyes is very fun like it's super expressive and the eyes like change um, to the different personality that the Furby has but I will say I don't really miss it. Like it's definitely fun and I'm glad they did it here but I don't know I really like these rainbow eyes and I feel like it feels more like a real creature without the LED eye. The LED eyes make it feel more like a robot, even though they are robots, but you know what I mean though, right? Like this feels more like a creature. This one kind of feels more like a robot and it's kind of terrifying when they sleep. <laughs> but yeah, they're both great Furbies, but I will say 
I'm very happy with this new one. It has so many like features and it says so many different things and it's really really fun. I think that kids will love this one. I definitely recommend it um, and especially like if your kid has like anxiety or something i think that this probably like the chill out features will actually really help the breathing exercises i think will help a lot of kids i think that's just a really cool thing because you know mental health is 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 serious and a lot of kids go through it a lot of very young kids go through it too and i feel like something like this genuinely might help this would be a great gift for a kid or you know even i'm not a kid obviously i'm an adult who collects toys but um you know maybe you have someone who's who's an adult like me and, and likes them um, as well. But yeah, I, th I think he's really, really cool. Maybe we'll see like a more expensive Furby that can move its mouth and body like this one one day. I would like to see that to be honest, but I would be worried about the price point. So yeah, that's my comparison. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about the new Furby. If you had any Furbies as a kid, like which one you had. Yeah, let me know your thoughts. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.